In southern India, there is a proverbial statement of how a coconut tree is useful when it's alive and when it's dead. Every part of the coconut tree is useful even after its life. Similarly, a human being has opportunity that when we are alive, we can be absolutely useful and contributory to life around us. And similarly, we can be even after life is up. Organ donation is such a possibility that if we can make a difference for another life, even after our life is over, it's a great possibility that human beings should make use of. In our culture, there is no glorification after death. Within a few hours after a person's demise, his body is anyway burnt. Cremation is the way. So when that, that is so, if we can make use of the dead people's organs to transform another life, it's definitely a wonderful thing. But there is also another dimension to this. Every human organ is designed to last a lifetime. Why are we developing a culture that human organs are failing halfway down? So this is a culture that we have to develop, that individual people have to take responsibility to see that their bodies last for their lifetime. Bringing that culture also is important. You drink your liver to rot and then you want somebody else's li liver, this could generate an unhealthy trend. And there is also a marketplace which will evolve out of this and that could open up many dangerous possibilities. So organ donation is a fantastic thing on the individual basis, but on the larger context, we must be conscious and careful to see that this wonderful act of making a difference for another life does not develop into a huge market and bring all the other ugly things associated with it.